in the chat that we give as a blessing, saying just as the waters of the rivers fill the ocean full, so may all that is given here go to those who have passed away. Of course, in dedicating the merit, you don't lose the merit that you give away. They tell the story one time when some debt doe was receiving a meal in the palace and he was giving the blessing. And in the midst of the blessing, the king, who knew Pali, cried out, Why does everything go to the dead? And so some debt doe immediately changed it so everything that's given here goes to the king. Please the king. But again, that shows a misunderstanding. When we dedicate merit to others, it actually multiplies the merit we've already made. The fact that you're willing to share it shows a breadth of your heart. And that breadth of heart is an aspect of merit. Merit is one of those words we don't like in English. You know, tr translate it as goodness. The goodness goes to others. When you share goodness with others, you realize goodness doesn't get depleted by sharing it. It actually gets augmented, multiplied. So when you do something good like this, providing a meal, it's good to reflect that you actually did some good. It's not just the daily chore that you have to get out of the way before you get back to your practice. It is part of the practice. You want to treat it as part of the practice. And so learn how to appreciate the merit that you've done. And when you appreciate it, you think about other people too, how they could benefit from, from some merit, especially those who passed away. They don't know, have the opportunity to make merit, to do good anymore, as far as we know, especially the ones who are stuck in the realm of the hungry ghosts, just sitting around waiting for somebody to dedicate something to them. So be willing to share. Widen your heart. This is an aspect of goodwill practice. You widen your heart to be wider than the world. You have happiness, you'd like to see everybody else have a share of happiness. You develop a sense of well-being through the practice and you want others to share in that as well. But it's always good to stop and think for a minute that, that you really are doing good. And that lifts up the heart. When the heart is lifted up like this, then it's easier to open up and spread out, to realize you've got something good here, and other people can share in it, and it doesn't deplete the goodness. All too many people live in this world with a zero-sum game in their minds. If somebody else gains, they have to lose. If they're going to gain, other people have to lose. But here's a different mathematics. As you gain, other people gain as well. So appreciate what you've done, and be willing to share it with the dead, who nowadays include some dead toe and the king, wherever they are. They may be up in heaven, so may they rejoice in the merit that we've done.